These are not the heroes we need right now. I am trying to protect you. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top five worst things about the Inhumans TV series. This will be over in a second. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at the worst parts of the new ABC superhero show, and although viewership numbers haven't been the best, we're still issuing a spoiler warning. Number five, a confusing setup. I've never been to Earth. Regardless of what my genes might suggest, I'm an Inhuman like the rest of you. <coughs> the Inhumans had a long and confusing journey on their way to becoming television stars. The series revolves around a superpowered royal family forced to leave their home on the moon and flee to Earth. It was supposed to be a movie with a release date of November 2018, with Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. explaining the origins of Inhumans over multiple seasons. Welcome to the club. We call ourselves Inhumans. When the film was eventually cancelled and subsequently turned into a series, the setup didn't pay off. We got the same Inhuman information from new faces, and neither Agents nor Avengers showed up when the family splashed down in Hawaii. Even with years of setup, Inhumans feels disconnected from the rest of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Okay, everyone. Number four, awkward acting and dialogue. I don't care if it's painful. If you don't, I will kill your entire family and bring all their pieces to you in a garbage bag. Just because the Inhumans are technically aliens doesn't mean they have to act like it. The dialogue in each scene ranges from cliche to cringeworthy. Characters are constantly stating obvious facts and sliding into flashbacks. A lot of lines sound unnatural, leading to flat or over-the-top performances. In addition, due to Black Bolt's vow of silence, Simple conversations with him tend to lag. Are you not speaking? Are you one of those smart asses that's waiting for your lawyers to come and get you? Even Iwan Rayon, known for his terrifying role as Ramsey Bolton, struggles to bring weight to his lines and keep a consistent accent. We're sure there are quality actors in the cast, but their performances are buried underneath bad writing. Hang loose. Number three, not using their powers. The royal family's powers are actually cool when they get to use them. Karnak has the power to predict the outcomes of his actions, but head trauma stops his ability. Medusa can control her strong hair to fight, but it's shaved off in the first episode. And Black Bolt can flip cars over with a whisper, but refuses to use his powers because of tragic backstory reasons. Maybe it's the show's budget that prevents Crystal from turning all her enemies into icicles. However, if you're going to make a story about people with powerful abilities, it would be nice to see them in action. Number two, the costumes and effects. Superheroes don't always translate perfectly to live action, but in humans really misses the mark. Most of the costumes are plain dark outfits that blend into each other. When superpowers are actually shown on screen, they either flash by quickly or look unimpressive. By far, Medusa's moving hair suffers the most. The wig actress Sarinda Swan War was ridiculed after its first reveal, and trailers of her locks in motion only made it worse. Visual effects later enhanced the hair, but not before making a horrible first impression. In the end, the teleporting bulldog Lockjaw may be the best effect in humans was going for. Number 1. Inconsistent Tone The days of Black Bolt's rigid meritocracy are coming to an end. At the end of the day, we're just not sure what this series wants to be. Is it an epic class struggle? A fish-out-of-water comedy with aliens? A romance drama with some action scenes thrown in? Inhumans changes tones at a breakneck pace, leading to cheesy romantic scenes next to drug cartel shootouts. The lack of consistency makes it hard to connect to the main characters. And although other Marvel properties blend comedy and drama well, Inhumans struggles to find that balance. That's enough embarrassment for today. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.